This is Diamond Video, man. I should have knew that from the jump. Like, you know what I mean? But well, we're going to set it off tonight, man. You know what I'm saying? Man, do woe, kill him real quick. And, you know, make sure the people feel us, man. You know what I'm saying? This is a new, it's a new year, man. It's going to be crazy. I'm telling you, man. About It's about time for Rob to come off with some, some crazy news, man. And I'm telling you, I don't want to expose it right now. Well, something gonna happen, man. <laughs> All right, something gonna happen. One love, man. Peace to everybody. Happy birthday, whatever birthday it is tonight. We gonna kill it, and that's it, y'all. One love. Everybody. This is your number one girl, Diamond Video. I am here in Harlem, but yes, 125th Street, over here on the east side. I'm here to support my girl, Deborah Coco, aka Deborah Slater. Just give me the mic. She'll be here soon in a minute, so we'll be going to the camera. Let her tell her about this event. This is the Women of Empowerment event. It is fantastic. We have a lot of vendors out today. Um, the jewelry, with buttercream. I see buttercream. That's, I saw a name somewhere that says buttercream, so I hope it is soap or cream. But anyway, I'm sure it's great. But we're here to have to support each other. We're here to network. We're here to empower each other. Women empowerment. This is what this is all about. And Deborah Coco is one of the guest panelists, and I will be I have the honor of videotaping her to hear her speak about women empowerment. If you haven't seen her before, you need to go to her page. It's called Just Give Me the Mic. Deborah Coco. As someone would say, just love me some Coco. But she is fantastic. She is wonderful. She has so much energy and she has so much love to give and you have to go to her page and you have to see some of her events that she do so I'm very very happy that I was able to come out today and give her the support that she so very well deserved Hi, I'm Carmen B, the host of the Carmen B Show on itsapartyradio.com, and I'm the hostess for tonight of the Beauty Meets Strength event presented to you by The Home, and it is a great event. It is, a great, it is an event that integrates art and fashion to raise awareness for women's empowerment, women that have been through so much, women that have been through domestic violence, mental illness, rape. We need to uplift those women and let them know that they're going to be okay. And guess what? They are okay because we have women here that have been through that. They're entrepreneurs, and that's what we're here for, women empowerment. It's the room. We don't need strength, baby. Hi, this is Lakoto. I'm very happy to be here in the room. Uh, very excited. Uh, a lot of amazing artists. Please follow me as Maria Lakoto everywhere. And check out my music video, please. I just released it yesterday. The MBHP, the Mama Bicho y Hueputa song. The music video is out since yesterday, so check it out in my uh, YouTube page. And here is uh, Lanisi with me. She's a female rapper as well from back home, Puerto Rico. Yes, we are here. Maria was my model for my piel morena. And I came here to support her. This is Women Empowerment. This is the room. I am so excited to be here. And like she say, mama bicho y hueputa, te voy a meter con lo que tengo. So support her video, support mine, go to my YouTube page, Missy, Missy, La Misraim, and you can follow us. You'll see her on her link video for my video and her video. So you gotta support women, and that's, we gotta stick together. Stand up for yourself. Live for the week go. Just give me the mic and I have a show that is in the Bronx on Channel 68 comes on Sunday. I interview a variety of artists, people, it's positive people doing positive things. Right? I work with Ralph McDaniel who's on video music box. I do a show for him called 16 Bars, which is nice, legendary show, been in existence for over 35 years. Right? So clap it up for Ralph McDaniel. Right? But all I want to say is that. Love doesn't hurt, right? 
It's not supposed to, right? When people start giving you excuses about the way they treat you, right? And you're not feeling good. When somebody enters your life and they say they love you, I take that as a sign that you're coming and you're bringing positivity into my life, right? We're going to sit down, we're going to talk about how we can join, how we're going to join our energies together and we're going to build something and make something great, right? But somewhere or another, in some cases, things take a left turn, right? I don't know what it is. Somehow the communication goes down, people start losing respect for each other, People start taking each other for granted, right? We go on social media, we feel like we have all these options and everybody is so disposable. Everybody's so replaceable, right? So I'm one of those firm believers in love. I, I grew up reading storybooks. I saw the king coming in on the horse and kissing the sleeping beauty and all that stuff. I'm like, I want that, right? We all do, right? Is it really just a fairy tale? It is, right? It is. So we come with issues, bills, all this other stuff by the time we become adults, right? So it become a whole other thing. That fairy tale is out the window. But all I'm saying is, don't allow anybody to mistreat you. That's all I'm saying. If you have an instinct that's telling you that something is not right, you follow that. If you make someone accountable for how they're treating you and they keep repeating the action that keeps offending you, you got to walk away. Right? Because it's about self-love at the end of the day. People don't take the beauty of, at this age, as being adults, we meet people, they have family, we have family, we mesh with families, right? They don't even think about all the people that are involved when you join and to make a relationship. So when you go out there and you just cheat, or you just write somebody, meet up, and do things, you are affecting everybody that is involved within that union, whether you're married or not. It's just about respect. So I'm gonna keep it short, but make sure that you are respected, make sure you protect your boundaries, and realize that you're nobody's victim and you're always strong, and you always have that power to get out of whatever it is somebody's trying to hold you down, right? Whatever that situation is, you have the power, you have organizations like this that can help you. Always speak about what's going on, don't be ashamed ever of what you're going through, because it's a life experience, and this is part of your journey, right? So I just want to say goodnight, my name is Devin Coco, and thank you, and we are women, and we are beautiful, and we are strong. Hey everybody, this is your girl Deborah Coco. We are at the WOEM Women Empowerment is going on right now at the National Black Theater. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Uh, it's Maurice here. I'm here with the lovely DNA team. We just set the stage on fire. I want to give a shout out to Diamond V and the DNA's room team. Women Empowerment, we here, we coming. Stay tuned. You know, know the vibes, man. Hey yo, uh, shout out to Diamond V for this. Um, DNA is here, empowerment. Uh, uh, the womb, the woman of empowerment, we out here chilling. We just killed the stage. Yeah, Me and everybody out there, out here, we out here chilling. Hey man, you know the vibe. This your boy Easy. Follow me on IG, yes, Eli, straight like that, you know. You know the vibes, man. But if you don't know JP, you better ask somebody. Hey, Girl J Pre, follow me on Instagram, the real J Pre. That's J P R E E. Thank you to the womb. Shout out to everything they're doing, everything that they stand for, all the opportunities they've given us. Thank you so much. How you doing? This is Queen Libra. I want to say thank you so much for the room for having me open and supporting me with everything I do. Um, you can follow me on Instagram at real Queen Libra. One. Okay. My girl Maria in the building. Maria. Talk your girl, mommy. Sing it. Sing it. Your mommy, you know what I told you. Tell me, tell me. I want to hear it. <laughs> you know, I already told you that I'm very excited to be here. Please follow me as Maria La Coro Double T everywhere. And watch my music video. The video that I released yesterday. <laughs> I'm gonna make a concert dance. Okay, okay, I'm 
I'll tag it. I'll tag. You already know what's going on. Kaiser fucking bears. Actually, Kaiser fucking bears. If you want to say it correctly, but um, follow me on Kaiser bands. K Y Z A B A N D Z. That, you can put that into Google. And last but not least, my name is Benji. You can follow me at Benji B E N J I underscore the railroad. Shout out to Diamond V and everything. We appreciate y'all. Look out for us in the future. Hey. Thank you so much, guys. Good, good. Here to uh, support women empowerment, I'm Julie from First Time Bookings, and this is Stan Swayze of Ray Races Music, and we would like to give a big shout out to all the women, the honorees, the speakers, and all of the women of empowerment. Right, and we're here to also give a big shout out to Deborah Coco. Here I go. Deborah Coco and Jess, give me the mic. Yeah. Let me give her a big shout out. Major support. Major support. That's right. Hey, this is Ruby Rich, shouting out Deborah Coco. Thanks for inviting me to this beautiful event. I just want to talk a little bit about my brand and what we represent. We represent being rich in blood through fashion. We're here to teach our generation and the generations to come that you don't need money to be rich. It all comes from the heart. Again, thank you so much. Hey, this is Big Man Entertainment, Big Man in the building. Shout out to just giving the mic at Deborah Coco and to Rome. Women in Empowerment it was a beautiful event. I loved it. It was good camaraderie, great music, food. It was a full and promises show, and I hope we do more of this because our community needs it. Peace for Big Man Entertainment. Hello. Thank you so much for the people who came out to support the womb. I think it's very inspiring and everything that came along with it. It was great, it was a good event, it was a lot of artists, rappers, and all kind of things. The main thing is to continue to promote women and everything else, thank you. Cool. Hey, hey everybody, we had a great night tonight. I hope you enjoyed the show. Had some awesome entertainment, some great speakers, and it was just all love in the building and all positive energy was in the building. Shout out to Michelle Lee and DJ Mario TV for coming out and supporting and representing this event tonight. Again, I'm your girl Deborah Coco. You can catch me on Bronx Net Channel 68 at 10 p.m. on Sundays and 8 p.m. on MNN2 in Manhattan. And subscribe to Just Give Me The Mic on YouTube. Follow me on all social media, Deborah Coco and Just Give Me The Mic. And thank you so much for, I hope you enjoyed the show. Good night.